Hey guys, today I'm going to do a quick demonstration on how to print um, photos off the iPhone to uh, through Bluetooth um, to a device such as the what I have it is the Polaroid GL10 um, instant uh, printing with the zero ink paper. Um, I'm sure it works with the Polaroid Pogo as well. So if you have a smaller version of the Pogo, this will work um, printing through Bluetooth. You do need a jailbroken iPhone. And the third, you do have to purchase a third party uh, app through Cydia. So I what I have here is an iPhone 4S um, running iOS. 5.0.1 and um, I've already downloaded the third party app called AirBlue Sharing and I'll, I'll have more description um, about that app uh, below. So um, I downloaded the app and now uh, you do a quick setup here go to basically once you install the app you'll go to AirBlue and um, enable the secure simple pairing um, hopefully this is focused for you guys um, so you turn that on um, packet logging just leave that off and then um, air blue sharing um, I, I don't I, I don't touch this part so uh, you do have to turn off the native Bluetooth um, within the iPhone setting so um, as you can see I, there's not a um, Bluetooth icon there so turn that off um, air blue settings uh, air, air blue sharing will automatically turn on and turn off once you're done so then you go basically select the photo that you want uh, you want to print um, so for example uh, this is in my camera roll so I'm just going to uh, print this image through Bluetooth it's going to um, search for device and since I've already found the Polaroid um, if it's your first time pairing uh, it's going to ask you for a code so that code with the default GL10 is 6000 I'm not sure about the Pogo so uh, once you connect um, it's going actually going to send the file to the um, uh, the my GL10 uh, printer. So and we'll just wait. Oh, here we go. So you you can definitely hear the uh, printing process. So, um, I've turned on the borders, and because um, I like that original Polaroid look and feel, the quality is actually uh, pretty good um, compared to previous generation. So, the the actual printing time is very fast, but the file setting, I'm sure, depending on the size of the file. Um, so as you can see we printed it successfully um, so you can see the quality it has that uh, vintage look to it which is pretty cool let me see if it's a better focus here so it's um it's pretty neat um I'm sure you can do a lot of different projects with this. Well, if you guys have any questions or concerns, um, leave them below. And thank you guys for watching.